felt blindsided. I feel like she felt blindsided until she said one thing. She said, well, I know that I know that you like to dress in women's clothing sometimes, but I had no idea. And at that moment, my antennas went up. <laughs> you knew that he liked to dress up in women's clothing, but you didn't think that he had an affinity toward maybe wanting to become a woman or that something was going on with him regardless of what he told you after you saw him dressed as a woman you you didn't think that he would ever want to be a woman or ever lean towards something else that was that was interesting to me and so I don't want to talk about the transformation or speak on any of that what I want to get at is ignoring the signs we have got to stop ignoring the signs because I could not help but feel as if if Chris had of been a little more proactive a long time ago maybe she could have got out of the marriage out of the relationship before before sooner and now she's in this pain and now she's grieving because she ignored the signs she allowed she didn't I don't know I don't know how many times have we ignored signs how many times have we known that a man wasn't ready for a relationship but we stayed how many times have we been in a marriage and we've been with someone that we were incompatible with but we stayed 10 years too many how many times have we gone out on dates with guys and from jump you knew you were incompatible you knew he was a playboy you knew you couldn't see a future with him, but you stayed because you thought things would change because you thought he would change, that you could change him. You cannot change a man. That is not what life's about. But I was just moved when I watched the documentary and I wanted to come and tell you, don't ignore the signs. If there's something going on that you aren't quite too sure about, pray about it ask for discernment ask to be able to understand a person's spirit and their energy as you are bringing them into your life but don't ignore the signs if this man is dating 10 women if his phone is ringing non-stop 24 hours a day don't ignore the signs <laughs> If this person is not treating you well, if they're disrespectful to you, if they are negative in your life, if they if they don't build you up, if they're not positive, if they're envious, if they're jealous, if they're angry all the time, don't ignore the signs. Whatever the sign may be, don't ignore the signs. If you're not sure, pray about that thing. Do some investigations, but by all means, you have to put yourself first. You have to protect yourself. You have to protect your sanity. You have to protect your peace of mind. You have to protect your heart. You have to protect your purpose. You have to protect your future. You have to protect yourself, your time, your energy. You have to protect your productivity and engaging yourself with someone who is not for you hinders that and it threatens all of those things that I just mentioned. Protect yourself. Look at the signs. Blinking red lights in your face. This man is not ready for a relationship. This man doesn't believe in your dreams. This man cause you out of your name this man doesn't respect you this man isn't introducing you to his family this man doesn't want to introduce you to his friends this man doesn't want to take you out on a nice date this man doesn't want to spend time with you this man doesn't want to do things with you this man does not want to treat you like the queen that you are don't ignore the signs 
whatever they may be, don't ignore the signs. When you see something, when you feel it in your gut, look into that thing. Pray about it. Sometimes you don't even have to do anything and the Lord will show you. He will send somebody to tell you something. He will send you a, a vision in a dream. He has ways of delivering messages to us. Everything will be revealed in its due timing. If you don't have all the answers, pray about that thing. Meditate on that situation and everything that's being done in the dark will be revealed in the light. I promise you. I promise you, but I beg of you, don't ignore the signs. There's somebody out there right now, you're going through something and you know you're ignoring some signs. You know you're giving someone your time that you're not compatible with. You know you're in a relationship five years too many. You know that you have been wasting your time, but you're afraid to walk away. You're afraid to take that step because you don't want to walk into the fear of the unknown. You can do anything you put your mind to. All you need is your creator. You can do it. You can begin again. You can see me start when you turn on your screen. You can see me start when you turn on your screen. I'm bigger than life. I'm bigger than life. I'm the number one chick. I don't need no hype.